To leave the cockpit, reach forward and grab the windscreen. Pull yourself forward as far as possible before attempting to move upward. This is particularly important if you were unable to release your chute before submerging. With the plane in nose down attitude, leaving the cockpit is more difficult. Your buoyancy resists your effort to pull yourself forward. There's greater danger that your chute will hang up. In the tail down attitude, your buoyancy works for you, making the whole job easier. In the inverted attitude, follow the same procedure. Breathing may be a little more difficult with a full pressure suit. If the breathing regulator is in the seat pan, it is now above you and senses less pressure than your lungs demand. Don't panic. You can still breathe even though it takes a little more effort. If your chute hangs up, don't try to unfoul it. Every second you waste can send you down another 10 feet. Release the riser fittings and swim free. Never inflate your life jacket until you are completely free of the aircraft. This pilot made that mistake, and this is what happens. He tries to reach his riser fittings. They're no longer where they should be. It's very doubtful he'll find them in time. 